Okay, so let's play. Counting on Nia. Nia is a really clever engine. She's good at finding her way around Sodor. That's the third buffer I've hit this week. I can't seem to find my way around Sodor. And she knew the names to all the stations. Knapefard. It's Knapford. Tidemouth. It's pronounced Tidmouth. Here we are at Wheelsworth Station. Oh, it's pronounced Wellsworth Station, Nia. Don't you know the names of the stations yet? She's also great at solving problems. Yar! How will I ever sort this mess out? I'll sort it out, Salty. There! Problem solved. Yar! Come on, come on! Move! It's no use blowing your horn, Gordon. But I'm pulling the express, and I can't be late. Wait, I have an idea. Thank you, Nia. That was very savage. Good morning, sir. Oh, Nia. How would you like to work with Annie and Clarabelle today? Oh, yes, please. This is so exciting. Then it's settled. You can pick up your passengers from platform to <laughs> platform. Two. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. Oh, not platform three, Nia. We want to be on platform two. Oh, <laughs> of course. This is platform one. Sorry. <laughs> Wow, that was close. That's platform two over there, Nia. The one with the funny looking clown. Was that a speed limit sign, Clarabelle? I think so, Annie. And there goes another one. We need to slow down. There you go. You're back on track, Nia. Dear, oh dear, Nia. Didn't you see the speed limit signs? Uh, yes, sir. I did see some signs. Then you should have slowed down. Yes, sir. I'm very sorry, sir. Nia, why are we stopping here? This isn't where we're supposed to be. I've let the fat controller down. And now everyone will think I'm silly. Oh, Nia! Everyone already thinks you're silly. Quite right, Annie. Carly told us how you sorted the trucks out at the docks. <laughs> Just look at this mess, Carly. Aye, Cranky. Only a really silly engine would have done that. And Gordon told us about how you lured that cow off the tracks. 
My cow! What silly engine let these cats out? So you see, Nia, everyone already thinks you're silly. But I'll never be a really useful engine if I don't know numbers. <laughs> oh, you don't know numbers? Well, that's very silly. Wait till we tell Sir Topham Hat. I know how to count, all right. One, four, seven, twenty-two, seventy-three. That's a silly way to count. And I know that there's three pirates over there. <laughs> oh my! You really don't know numbers. But I don't know those squiggly signs people call numbers. How can you not know numbers? There's a number written on the side of your cab. So that's why you didn't slow down. Well, we can teach you numbers. The number one is tall and straight. Oh, you mean like Cranky. Cranky's not that tall. <laughs> what? And two is curved with a straight line. You mean like Harvey rescuing that engine. <laughs> um, something like that. Three is rounded on one side. Like Henry's number. Who's Henry? The engine you replaced on the steam team. <laughs> Awkward. The number four crisscrosses. Hmm. Aha. You mean like that random train accident? Um, yes, Nia. Like the train accident. Soon, Nia learned what the rest of the numbers looked like. Nia was having fun with numbers. Hello, number one. That's right. I am the number one engine. And don't you ever forget it, Ryan. <laughs> what did I do? What's my number, Nia? You're number seven. And what's my number? Seven. And what's my number? Seven. <laughs> this is a very confusing railway. And what's my number? <laughs> um. And what about my number? <laughs> I'm not too sure. What about my number, Nia? <laughs> wow, numbers are hard. Oh well. Back to the old ways, I guess. Well, no more numbers for me. It's Trackmaster Race Day here on the Sodor Superstation Speedway. Pick your engine. Team Great Race. Shooting Star Gordon, Young Bao, the Flying Scotsman. Team Journey Beyond Sodor, Merlin, Hurricane, Lexi. Day of the Weasels, Day of the Daddies? Okay, Day of the Daddies then. Diesel, Salty, Philip. Philip needs to fill up. Fill up on gas or fill up on coal? Ladies of Sodor, Ashima, Emily, Nia. Yeah, here's all our old engines. I call these Sodor originals. Steven, Hero, wow, look at Hero. Hero is a superhero. Is he a superhero? Glenn. Glenn has a grin on his face. Oh yeah, look at that, Glenn has a grin. Team Green, Steam, and maybe Mean. I don't think they're very lean though. Percy, Gerald, Henry. Ooh, Sodor Originals off the bat. I choose Glenn. You want Glenn? I want Grin. You want Glenn the Grin. Journey Beyond Sodor, oh that would be Merlin. Glenn versus Merlin, any predictions here, William? You're going with, uh, you're going with Mr. Visible? I'll take Mr. Coffee Pot. Ready, set, go! They're off and here comes Merlin around the bend. Looks like Glenn is slightly ahead, but will it be enough? Will he maintain the lead? Oh, what happened? Neither engine. Oh, is he, is he hitting it? Come on, come on Merlin, it looks like he might be inching and he goes through. The flag doesn't go up, but we'll, you wanna call that a win for Merlin? A little bit of technical difficulties, we've already sorted it out. Merlin, on to the second round. Ooh, day of the diesels. Philip. Philip? Oh, 
in Team Green. Croc. Oh, you choose Croc? Mm -hmm. Gerald it is. Philip and Gator, any predictions, William? Gator because Philip needs to fill up and he's running low on gas. Philip, you, you want Gator because Philip needs to fill up. That's punny. Ready, set, go! Here comes Philip, the box cab diesel. He's going around. His, oh, and he is ahead of Gator. Will it be enough to get the win? It looks like Philip has defeated Gator and will go on to the next round. Great race. Three big tender engines. Liam, any prediction? Oh, Gordon's brother, Flying Scotsman. Ladies of Sodor, I think Nia is the right engine for this. Flying Scotsman versus Nia. I know that Nia is Liam's favorite engine, so I think that Flying Scotsman's gonna win. Ready, set, go! They're off, and here they go, Nia. Wow, well ahead, and she is right going to take out Scotsman as she goes on, and both engines crash into the snow. Nia, very dominant over the Flying Scotsman. Oh, Journey Beyond Sodor. Hurricane? And Team Green. Percy? Hurricane and Percy. Liam, any thoughts? Tornado. You're gonna choose Hurricane? Yes. Good. I'm choosing Percy. Reminds me of my friend King Percy fan. Ready, set, go! They're off and Hurricane is coming around. Oh no, is he slightly ahead of Percy? No, it's neck and neck. I think Percy is slightly ahead and yes! Percy! Gets the checkered flag, falls off immediately afterwards. Hurricane ends up in a tsunami of snow, but Percy will go on. Percy delivers the mail on time, folks. Oh, ladies of Sodor, Ashima or Emily? Which one do you think, bud? Ma. Ashima Emily? Day of the Diesels. Day of the Daddies. Which one of these do you want? Oh, I do love to be in the side. Nice. It's Crash and Repair Salty versus Hyper Glow Ashima. Liam, any predictions? You want Salty? I know Veronica's favorite is. Yeah. Ready, set, go! And they're off, and here comes Ashima. Will it be enough? And they crash and repair slightly ahead here. Crash and repair goes through and crashes Ashima. Oh no, too late. Wow, even Salty was surprised by that outcome. Journey Beyond Sodor, Lexi, our final engine. Okay, are you gonna spin, Josie? You spinning? <laughs> ah, Day of the Diesels. That means Josie Posey picks Diesel. Lexi versus Diesel. Liam, any predictions on this one? Flexi, Lexi. Experimental engine, Flexi, Lexi. I'm, Dad's gonna Flexi. go with Diesel. Ready, set, go! They're off, and here comes Diesel. I think he's gonna be slightly, oh, they're pretty close here. What's gonna happen? This could be really close. It looks like Lexi pulled ahead. And coming slightly from behind, Lexi takes out Diesel. Great race. I choose this guy. You want Shooting Star Gordon? You got it. Ooh, Ladies of Sodor. You choose Emily? You guys got it. Shooting Star Gordon versus Emily. Any picks on this one? Liam, you picked Shooting Star? I know who Veronica's gonna pick. Ready. Set, go, they're off, and here they come. Emily looks a little bit smaller. It looks like, whoa, Emily has fallen off. Gordon will go through and on, and he falls off as well. But look at Emily, she is trapped. What happened there, I have no idea. And in a big surprise, shooting star Gordon takes it. Emily gets her tender hooked up and doesn't even make it down the hill. Green. I think your choice is Lean Green Fighting Machine, Henry. Sodor Originals. I choose Steven. You want Steven? Yep. Steven it is. Henry versus Steven, King of the Railway versus Special Cole here. William, who do you think is gonna win? Look at the size of the face difference. Wow, poor Henry. King of Sodor, I'm going with the Green Caterpillar. Mm. Ready, set, go! They're off and here comes Steven the Rocket around and I think he's slightly ahead of Henry, he is. He will go down and go through and get derailed. Henry goes on and falls into the snow. Steven, oh yeah, looks like his tires are off. Well done for you, Magoo. Crashing at the end because his big face couldn't make it through the finish line, but he does finish first. That's the rocket. Our final race of the first round is actually Team China versus Team Japan here. The two Oriental engines, these guys are very similar. Young Bao takes on Hero of the Rails. William, do you have any predictions? Who do you want to see win this race? The master of the railway? 
I'll go with Young Bao then. Ready, set, go! They're off and Young Bao coming around. It looks like he's well ahead of Hero as he makes it to the junction point and he goes through and Hero will come in second. Young Bao takes out his rival Hero and makes it onto the second round. Welcome to the second round. All six teams have made it with no clear winners at this time. Team Green, Percy it is. Ooh, Journey Beyond Sodor. The choices are Merlin and Lexi. I'm gonna choose... Merlin! I think I'm gonna choose Merlin. Percy and Merlin, any predictions here, William? Oh. You're picking Merlin, good. I'm gonna keep going with Percy. Ready, set, go! They're off, and here comes Percy McGursey around. It looks like it's gonna be pretty tight, but Merlin is slightly ahead. And he goes on to win it, eliminating Percy. Stunning upset as Merlin makes Percy disappear. Sodor Originals. They call me the Rocket. Day of the Diesels. Philip or Salty? Hmm. Oh, Philip? Philip needs to fill up. I'm the fastest engine on Sodor. Ooh, 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 I beat Gordon in a race once. We have any predictions on these two? I think you're gonna go with Philip, aren't you? Yeah, you want Philip, I'm gonna take Steven. Ready, set, go! They're off, Philip coming around the bend, number 68, but he looks very close. Steven going down, he is ahead, and Steven goes on and goes through. Philip, what happened? You got stuck as he's shaking the fireworks. You know, the Rocket's doing pretty good here, buddy. Day of the Diesels again. Yar. Journey Beyond Sodor. Lexi. Lexi and Salty. William. Any predictions? Salty? Okay. I also choose Salty. I don't think Lexi has it in her. Ready, set, go. They're off. Salty crashing and repairing. Lexi on the other side. It looks like Salty slightly ahead. Goes on and goes through. Oh. It looks like Salty is in the crash and repair engine on this raceway today. No surprise as the Dockside Diesel takes out an engine that is too experimental for her own good. <laughs> Ladies of Sodor, Nia it is. That means Nia has to go up against one of these two engines which are both great race. William, which engine do you choose to go on and face Nia? Old Bow? That means Shooting Star Gordon will be back to challenge our eventual winner in the final. But until that time, it's a big world, big adventure on the next race as Nia of Africa takes on Young Bao of China. William, any predictions? Kenya, you're picking Kenya? Kenya, Nia it is. Ready, set, go! They're off, Nia coming around the inside track. Young Bao on the outside, looks like Nia slightly ahead. Goes on and goes through. Very interesting outcome. Nia eliminates Young Bao. We're down to the final four. Congratulations if you pick one of these four engines. Crash and Repair Salty, Merlin, Nia, and Steven the Rocket. Oh, Journey Beyond Sodor. I'm invisible. Ooh, and ladies, it looks like it's Nia. Merlin and Nia, the race that nobody asked for. William, Nia is now your new favorite engine. I'm gonna go with Merlin. I just think that old invisible King Arthur engine has a few tricks up his sleeve. Ready, set, go! Nia taking the inside track is coming around. She's on track and on time. Looks like Merlin, this is gonna be very close. Who's gonna win? I don't know. Nia falls in. Merlin on the edge. Who won that race? It was, oh wow. Merlin. What an exciting race. Wouldn't that be something if Merlin actually won today? And the second semi-final race will be Steven the Rocket versus Crash and Repair Dockside Diesel Salty. Liam, any predictions? You want you want Steven? Ready, set, go! They're off! And here is Crash and Repair Salty on the inside track. Looks like Steven is slightly ahead and he is. As he's going down, goes through. Salty ends up in the snow, but Steven crosses the finish line first and takes the checkered flag. And here we are in the final. Who would have thought that the Rocket, Steven, and Merlin the Invisible would be here in the final of today's race? Liam, who do you think is gonna win it all? I you think Steven's gonna win? I think Steven's gonna win too, actually. But uh, you know what, just, just for pity's sake, I'm gonna pick Merlin. He might do it. Ready, set, go! Here they are, Steven will take the inside track, but will it be enough? I think Merlin might have a slight lead, and he does. As he races down, an unbelievable, in traditional Merlin fashion, he crashes at the end, but he takes the checkered flag and wins today's Sodor Superstation Speedway Challenge. Merlin, unbelievable fashion, actually wins a race. I can't believe this. He is the winner today, but as promised, he has a special challenger 
from shooting star Gordon. Liam, do you think Merlin will hold on to the title or do you think he'll immediately lose it to Gordon? Do you think he's gonna keep winning? Ready, set, go! Merlin will take the inside track and he speeds along. Shooting star Gordon lives up to his namesake but he's a little bit slow. And he is the one that ends up crashing out but it doesn't matter because Merlin has defended his title. He takes the checkered flag and shooting star is left just doing a, some kind of weird dance at the finish line. And in traditional King Arthur fashion, Sir Robert Normanby presents the winner, Merlin, the King Arthur style engine, with a horse for no reason whatsoever. I think this is your first time winning the Sodor Superstation Speedway. Hopefully it's not the last, my friend. Pick your engine. Nia, glowing Pussy. Glowing Ashima, Fiery Steam Thomas. Henry, Harvey, Bumblebee James, Thomas comes to Sodor, Charlie, Hero, Steven the Rocket, Trophy Thomas, Flying Scotsman, Young Bao, Merlin. That joke actually never gets old. <laughs> Turbo Diesel, Lexi, Emily, Flynn, Boo, Gruff, Glowing Edward. And we're going to launch these guys down the playground slide and see how far they go. Why is everything upside down? I don't know why everything's upside down. Maybe because you're a big weirdo. All right, William, which engine do you want to go first? Nia. Nia, Nia? Uh huh. That's not Nia, Nia. Nia from Africa in her first attempt. Let's see how she does. Here comes Nia down the line and the track. What's going to Oh, she goes for a tumble. Whoa, what a first jump! And her farthest distance, 10 feet, four inches for Nia. Who's gonna be next, buddy? Steven. Steven the rocket? Uh -huh. Let's see how he does. Steven, the king of the railway, we're gonna see if he can beat Nia. And here's Steven, king of the railway, he will be launched. Oh, and he takes a tumble, not nearly as close as Nia. We're gonna call that four foot eight for Steven. Liam, who's gonna be next? Percy? Mm -hmm. Let's get Neon, or does this glow in the dark Percy? Glow in the dark Percy, it's a pretty bright day, so I don't think he'll be glowing today. He's gonna come over, he gets launched, and he goes down, he, oh, wow. He hit Steven, unreal. What are the odds that he hit Steven? Four foot four for Percy. Veronica, who do you think should be the next engine? Ashima? Ashima of India. Let's see how far she can launch off this tropical launch thing. She will be, she be launched and she goes and she flies down and she passes Steven. Down enough to hit Nia. We'll call it five feet, one inch. Let me guess who the next one you guys pick is. Uh, you guys are just doing this in order, aren't you? Yeah. Are you guys just doing this in order? Just to be silly guys? Yes. Sodor Search and Rescue Center, Real Steam Thomas, our slowest engine, I think, isn't he? Real Steam Thomas comes around the bend. He will be launched, and he goes, and he flies, and oh, wow! Look at that! Wow, he is just short of Nia. Nia made it a little bit more, 10 foot four, Nia, just a little bit farther than Thomas on this point. I don't know which engine's gonna be next. Who will it be out of all these engines? Henry. You guys are just going down the line in order, aren't you? Yeah. And here's an engine that can never be replaced. It's Henry. Henry coming around, ready to get launched. Let's watch I this shot. Ah, oh, what a flight. And he goes far. He's currently in third place. <laughs> Eight feet and one inch for Henry. Are you just gonna pick Harvey or are we gonna pick someone else? You're just gonna pick Harvey. I wanted to replace Henry. Okay. Hey, if the crane train falls down, who picks him up? Helpful Harvey, number 27 on your scorecards, but number one in your hearts. Here comes Harvey with that giant hook. Let's see how he makes out here. Wow, he goes five foot two inches is the extent of his length. I'm gonna guess the next one is gonna be Lexi. Oh, Bumblebee James, hey, come back here. Hey, come, what are you doing? Get back buzz, here. Buzz, 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 buzz. Here he is, folks, the fastest red engine on Sodor. Bumblebee James slowly makes his way around the track. He will get up to the launcher and get launched. 
Oh, takes a tumble and he ends up with the rest of the group. Okay, well, who's next? I wonder. Oh, big surprise. Thomas comes to Sodor and then goes through the jungle jumps turbo set and ends up at the bottom of the slide. Here comes Thomas, catch him if you can. Launches, whoa, great somersault. Three foot seven inches for Thomas comes to Sodor. Okay, it's your pick, Veronica, and you're gonna, oh man, Charlie. Charlie, it's Charlie. <laughs> Charlie, joke's on you. <laughs> Charlie, he's actually, he does really well in these competitions. I don't know why, but let's give him the benefit of the doubt. I hope he wins. Here comes Charlie coming up to the turbo launch. Get launched. Oh, wow. He, whoa. Wow. He always does so good in these competitions. Look at that. He hit the fence, folks. Wow. All the way to the fence. That's a surefire win. <laughs> Liam is going to pick, surprise, surprise, Trophy Thomas. Oh, hero. Hero of the rails, it's gonna take a hero to beat Charlie after that last race. Hero of the rails now, coming around, getting ready to get launched. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Oh man, that was, oh, he went wide. Yeah, he looks ahead of Steven and James, but behind Ashima even. Okay, we wonder who's gonna be next, and it turns out to be Scruff. This is not even a surprise for us anymore, Scruff. Scruff the Scruncher, cleanest engine on all Sodor. No. Scruff, this is gonna be a good launch, I can feel it. Good tumble, and he hit some engines, but he still goes far. Enough to put him into fourth place right now. Oh, and it's Trophy Thomas. Ground control to Major Thomas. Trophy Thomas with that big lightning bolt across his side. Let's see if this will be a trophy winning performance. Whoa, he went, wow, look at that. Right past Henry and into fourth place. <laughs> Down to eight more engines. Will any of these guys be able to defeat Charlie? Up next, it's gonna be, surprise, surprise, Flying Scotsman. Here's Flying Scotsman, better known as Gordon's little brother. Charlie, sorry, not Charlie, Flying Scotsman now just launched. Wow, what a great launch. He went far. Not as far as even Henry, though. <laughs> who are you gonna pick? I wonder. We all wonder. Everyone wonders. Who are you gonna pick? Young Bao. No surprise there, folks. Young Bao of China, one of our favorites here on Kids Toys Play. We love this guy. Oh, wow, what happens when he gets launched? Oh, and he got caught in the grouping, folks. Five foot, four inches for Young Bao of China. I think we all know who's next, so let's just pick Merlin and be done with this part of it. Merlin the Invisible, the butt of an ongoing joke here on our channel. Here he comes, Merlin the Invisible. Let's shoot him off into infinity. Oh, he went a little bit far, almost as far as Scruff right there. That was a really good shot. Five foot three inches for Merlin the Completely Invisible. And we all wonder that the next one is going to be, oh wow, Turbo Diesel, what a surprise. Turbo Diesel is far and away one of the coolest engine designs ever out of any track master. Going to get launched here. Bam, nice show, but he gets caught in the grouping there. Hey, he turned himself off. Down to the final four, Lexi next on the chopping block. You know, looking at Lexi's engine design, I wonder why they didn't make more cab forward boiler engines like this. Go, go, Lexi. Lexi number zero. Oh, she, oh yeah, she has a number zero. These engines are now getting caught up in the grouping pretty good. What do you guys think? We should do Emily? Okay. I think that was a yes. Excellent, Emily. Will she be able to dethrone Charlie? It's, we need someone to beat Charlie. Will she be the one? Oh, misfire. Oh, wow. She did terrible. Okay, last chance for Emily. We might be able to see what causes her to misfire. She is terrible at that jump. She really is. We're down to the final two. Will either glow in the dark Edward or Flynn the firefighter be able to dethrone Charlie Magoo of being in the top position here? What do you think, William? Awesome. 
Firefighter Flynn, one of the favorites here on Kids Toys Play that we never make fun of ever. Fiery Flynn to the rescue. Good somersault for Flynn, but he ends up over by Hero. Brightest, longest day of the year. Good thing we have glow in the dark Edward to help us see in all this light. And here he is, Edward, glow in the dark, getting lost. Fire! And he is off and it is all over. Edward nowhere near Charlie here. And Trackmaster Charlie seems to be the best overall engine we have, winning all these World's Strongest Engine competitions as well as the long jump. Our question, can any Trackmaster engine defeat Charlie? Okay, show us, Liam, show us your tricks. Backflip! Oh, good backflip, and oh, he's a backward somersault. Another one, and he lands it, folks. Unbelievable. Whoa, and he's going, he's a backflipping monkey man fool. What do you guys think of this one? Look at the 81. detail. What number is this? 18. From Thomas Big World Big Adventure. It's yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's my favorite. What are you doing with that elbow? I can't put that. This spells Nia. She's from Africa. What are you gonna do with that Nia egg, honey? Oh, is it the elbow smashes, you kids? Elbows. I'm trying to break this thing. Oh, it's starting to crack. Oh, oh, there it goes. My. Oh, Veronica, you lost the bat. Oh, yeah, now Nia's getting it. Let's see what's inside. William's pulling something out. What is it? It's this beach. The summer day beach set. Do you want to open it up? Hey, wow, look at that piece. Yeah. I've never seen a piece like that before. This is a very special Sir Topham hat. This is the guy I wanted to get this set for. It's got some sand in there. There's a crab and some starfish and a clam. Oh, oh bright blue cargo car. We got another rosy posy. Look at that. Oh, and we finally have a Thomas. Finally. We got some really unique looking pieces here. I haven't seen some of these pieces before. Hmm, yeah. delicious. Hmm, ice cream. I'll be over here. What else do we have in here, honey? This is the Leap and Splash Dolphin Rescue. It's got some really unique pieces in here too. Look at that net, cool. This is an awesome set, let's see it. Ah, ah, oh, oh. Killiam, show us how this works. Oh, he is dolphin, he's doing tricks. Got the big cargo car, and we finally have a Thomas. I'm so happy about that, finally. Let that, hey, that looks like a very happy dolphin. I'm just happy with that one. You need to get in my belly. Looks like Sir Topham Hat's about to eat all that fish. Yep, he ate all the fish and now he's taking a nap. Oh look, Percy is going along the tracks in the back. Okay, it looks like we're lifting some type of whale out of the water here. And let's lower him down gently. Well, I would say it's not a big one though. Oh! Mm -hmm. What should we call this dolphin? Should we name him Flipper or Trixie? Yeah, yes. Africa. Oh wow, Brio! 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 Dynamite tunnel! Let's check it out. Okay, so we've got this tunnel, but what happened? Show that. Oh, the dynamite goes in there and oh! Now we have a tunnel! Let's explode this. Explode it again. Oh! What's happening? Not Who's going there? Oh! That's <laughs> just one piece. <laughs> ah, you're free, Thomas! We don't want to lose him. He's our only Thomas ever. No. Nia! Oh, you found something. I Who's found this? Thomas. Hey, we finally have a Thomas. This is a really rare one. Look at this one, Liam. This is a very old Thomas because he's battery operated, but he goes both forwards. He can also go backwards though. Let's see if he can climb backwards. He did it. He did it. Better than that, Thomas. Whoa, what's that? Bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. Oh, what's this? I think that's the rest of it. Let's open it up and find out. Okay, So the, this head went together and Thumper would hit the, which makes the, the ball go down and hit the house. I'm not sure the house deserves to fall over like that. Womp womp. What do you think of this, Nia? Oh, what do we have? Oh, wow, we got the forward backwards Percy. Do you want to race him? Okay, super loud Thomas, super loud Percy. Let's go. Hello. Oh, who's going to win, guys? It's going to be Percy. Percy and Rama's neck and neck. Wow, they're really eating. Yeah. This is really, really even. I don't know who's going to fall off first. It's pretty even. 
Oh. And they're off, and here they go, and it looks like they're dead even. I get oh, maybe Percy oh, by a hair. Tiny, tiny little itsy bitsy. But he's not gaining much, yeah, Percy. Hey, he is eating that guy. Hey, hey, whoa. Hey, it's the backwards forwards James of those guys. Right on. Go, and they're off, and it looks like it's very close, but Percy's in the lead, followed by Thomas with James rolling. This is really close race, guys. That egg is almost as big as you, my love. Maybe a bit bigger. Oh, who's this? Do you guys know who this is? Lady Hat. That's Lady Hat. Here they are together again, the happy couple, Lady Hat, Sir Topham Hat. All right, do you think she can spin? The dolphin's watching, let's see. <laughs> oh! There are dynamite sticks. Let's see if dynamite will go. Oh, boom! Oh! I'm going to eat it at the end. Um, 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 oh, um, hey, um, a nice um, serving. Um, um, oh, 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 oh. You're pretty deep in there, are you? Who's that? It's Neville. And Neville's tender. And he's just blacked right out. We, Ooh, we Neville. Finally. Oh yeah, does he not have the tender? This is a unique looking tender. Look, it's got the ladder on the back and it's got the coal in the middle and the water. Oh, day out with Thomas 2010. The celebration tour. We've got 2010 day out with Thomas. That means we have every single day out with Thomas except 2008. I think we're gonna open these up someday, don't you think, these three? We'll open them up maybe on a live stream. What do you guys think? I can't see. Oh, you got Percy in the musical caboose. Percy's musical guy. Percy with streamers looks like a Percy, but he's got streamers. And the musical cargo car. Play music for dolphins. Oh, another fire brigade. This is the fire brigade train. This is going to be helpful for Flynn. Ah, ah, hey, uh -oh. which one is this? Fire. Oh. Let's open this guy up. This is Fiery Flynn. Yeah. Fiery Flynn to the rescue! This guy is going to be featured in some of our videos. Look at that detail. He is on fire. Oh, he's got soot all over his face. Percy! Good to... Oh, no, I'm on fire! What do you have, honey? It's James, but it's Grey Wheel James. So this is the Grey Wheel James from Learning Curve. He's got his light on. Go, I guess. Oh, no, wow. You guys are just in uniform, but Grey Wheel James is the slowest. What's gonna happen here? Oh, what happened? Oh no, Percy goes right through. Oh, and James keeps going. Okay guys, what was inside the big Nia egg? Liam, can you tell us? The dolphin splash set, summer day at the beach set, forward, backwards, James, forward, backwards, Percy, forward, backwards, Thomas, and Grey Wheel James. The boulder drop set. Okay, whoa! We have to figure that out a little bit better. Lady hat, beached whale, finally got a Thomas. Percy's musical rush. Tale of Thomas 2010. Fiery Flynn. Fire Brigade. Neville. Real dynamite. Oh no! What was your favorite piece, William? Everything! You liked everything? I think you liked this the most, didn't you? Say goodbye, Dolphin. Oh! Dolphin! Uh -oh. I think my favorite is Fiery Flynn because then I get to use Flynn in more stories. Guys, get in the comment sections. Let us know what sets you like the best or which pieces you like the best and what you want to see more of. Welcome to Superstation Speedway. Pick your favorites. Team Great Race. Gina, Vinny, and Ashima. Team Big World Big Adventure. Rebecca, Nia, and Ace. Chase the Ace. Ace on his face. Ace without a place. Team Miniature Engines. Bert, Frank, Mike. Team Narrow Gauge. Proteus. Smudger, Duke. We haven't raced Duke in a while. Hi. Team Jack in the Pack. George, Jack, and Trevor. And Team Ghost. It's like Baby Ghost, Mama Ghost. And look at the size of this guy. This is the ghost with the most. Big World, Big Adventure. My favorite. Narrow Gage, Duke, Nia versus Duke versus the Duke. Ready, set, go! And wow! Very one-sided battle as Nia moves on. Miniatures. Oh, Mike. Great race. 
Oh, Ashima. Mike the Miniature and Ashima from India. Ready, set, go! Wow, who do you think won that one? That was far and away, Ashima wins that one. Big World, Big Adventure. You picking Rebecca? My favorite. Your favorite. Miniature engine. Where's my brother? Oh, your brother has been eliminated, Bert. It's up to you. I'm going to Hey, Bert's a miniature engine. Does that mean we can call him Bert the Squirt? <laughs> Versus Rebecca. This is going to be a good race. Set, go! Whoa, that was one-sided. Girls are continuing to dominate. Rebecca wins. Miniature engines again? Well, I'm gonna be frank, I guess. Jack in the pack. George? Yes, Papa. Frank versus George. Wow, one-sided. And Frank, representing the miniature engines, makes it to the next round. Narrow gauge. Proteus. Oh, and great race. At my auto. Oh, yeah. Gina versus Proteus. Go. Whoa. Gina. Gina. We had four ladies in this competition, and all four have made it to the next round. Gina. Narrow gauge. Oh. Jack in the pack. It's Trevor. Smudger. Oh yeah. Go! That was pretty close. Pretty close, but I think Trevor won. Great race. Who are you gonna pick? Sam. Okay. Finally! Go! I have been waiting for one of these. Which are you gonna pick that one? Vinny, far and away the best villain ever. And this is who, Baby Ghost? Yes. Let's see if Ghost can win. Go! And Vinny's been eliminated. It looks like Ghost is making it to the next round now. Big World, Big Adventure. Chase the Ace. I choose... Sir Top and Hat. Okay. Ghost! Which Ghost is gonna go up against Ace? Oh yeah, big ghost. Ace the racer with Sir Topham Hat driving him versus the ghost with the most. Set, go! Oh! Ace has chased the ghost with the most. That means we can see who this ghost is and it is Oliver pulling a red cargo car. Final race of the first round, we'll see Jack from Jack in the Pack go up against our final ghost. Go! Oh, Jack! Jack knocked the sheet right off this ghost. Let's see who it was. That ghost was Silver 60th Anniversary Percy, but Jack just plowed him right over. After the first round, Big World Big Adventures advances completely. Great Race has two advancing, as does Jack in the pack. That's a surprise. Miniature Engines have one engine, and Ghost has one engine, and Narrow Gauge have been eliminated completely. Oh, Jack in the pack. Oh, and Trevor? Great Race. This is a hard pick for me. That's a hard pick for you? Yeah. Who do you think is going to be Trevor? Gina? Yes. Looks like it's the battle of green engines with red wheels. Trevor versus Gina. Go! And unbelievable! I think Gina's a past champion, but Trevor just eliminated Gina and goes on to the next round. Jack in the pack. I think we might as well just go Jack on this one. Ooh, and Ghost. Now here's an interesting race. We've got Ghost and we've got Jack from Jack in the Pack. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh wait, he isn't there. There he is. Go! Oh, and Ghost eliminates Jack. Oh, miniature engine. Frank. Ooh, and the great race. That's Ashima. 
I think Ashima eliminated one of the miniature engines in the last race, didn't she? Let's see if Frank can get the revenge on Ashima or if Ashima's six small wheels will kick her to the next round. Ready, set, go! And that was close. That was so close, but Frank from the Miniature Engines has eliminated Ashima. The only engines left for the second round are from Big World Big Adventure. Only two can race and one can go on. William, which ones are going to race? Nia and Rebecca. Nia and Rebecca, we're gonna eliminate Ace. We'll let Ace come back and maybe challenge the winner later on. Let's have Nia go up against Rebecca to see who makes it to the third round. And here it is, this is the battle of the new Steam Team. Rebecca up against Nia, who will win? Go! That was close, but Nia edged out Rebecca. Here we are with the final four as Trevor, Ghost, Frank, and Nia make it to the third round. Oh, Ghost Train! And Miniature Engine, Frank the Tank versus the Ghost. Go! And that was one-sided. Frank wins and goes on to the very final. What a surprise move. That means we can reveal who this ghost was. William, who is it? Thomas. It is Shiny Wheeled 60th Anniversary Limited Edition Thomas. To see who's gonna join Frank in the final round, it's gonna be Nia and Trevor. Who do you think's gonna win this one? Nia. You think Nia? Go! That was so close, Liam. Do you know who won? Do you think it was Nia? I think we're gonna have to go to instant replay. Mm. Liam, that was one of the closest races we've ever seen, but in the instant replay, who won? Nia goes on, Trevor is eliminated. So in the very final race, who would have thought that this would be the final race for it all? Nia versus Frank. Pick your winner. Choose Nia. You chose Nia? Yes. I'll pick Frank. Go! Wow. That was an incredibly one-sided race, but Nia goes on to win it all. She is the overall winner, but we had to eliminate Ace earlier. Let's have one last race to see if Ace can challenge Nia. And in the final, it is a big world, big adventure as Nia and Ace. Let's just see what happens here. Go. Wow, Nia. <laughs> Nia definitely deserves to win after beating even the challenge from Ace. Nia is our Sodor Superstation Speedway Champion. Where is it? Hunt the truck. It has to be here somewhere. Hello, Nia. Is something the matter? Oh, hello, Edward. I'm looking for a covered truck. I left it here when I went to get refueled. And when I came back, it was gone. <laughs> All right, Bill and Ben. Where have you hidden Nia's truck? Don't ask us, Edward. She'll just have to find it. <laughs> but I need that truck now. That truck belongs to Sir Topham Hat. <laughs> okay, then. Shall I tell Sir Topham Hat you guys are up to your old tricks? I'm sure Victor has a can of blue paint waiting at the Steamworks for you. Fine, I'll get it. Spoil sport. I'm sorry about that, Nia. It's a new game they play called Hunt the Truck. The twins are quite mischievous. You're telling us. But luckily they're the only twins on all of Sodor. Twins are quite mischievous. Ugh, it's true. We're glad there's no other twins on the island. Well, this is awkward. Here you go, Nia. Sir Topham Hat's special truck. Nobody hides trucks better than us. Thank you, Edward. The trouble with you, Edward, is you don't like games. You're no fun at all. We're glad you were replaced on the Steam Team. Well, that's just mean. Oh. 
The next day, Bill and Ben returned to the docks. Hey Bill, look. I wonder where that truck is going. Oh, that truck? No, Porter, not that truck, that truck. Oh, that truck. That truck belongs to the Sonar Search and Rescue Center. No, 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 Porter, not that truck, that truck. Oh, that truck. Nobody knows who that truck belongs to. What? Let's just hide that truck anyways, Bill. I'm with you, Ben. So Bill and Ben coupled up to the special truck. Come on, Ben. Nobody can hide trucks better than we can. <laughs> Later on at the docks. Oh dear. Where is my special Christmas truck? The Earl will be very disappointed when he hears the sad news. It was just on that siding, Edward. What was in it? It was filled with all the festive decorations for the Christmas party at Alstead Castle, along with all the presents for the children, and even all the food for Christmas dinner. <laughs> Without that trailer, Christmas will be ruined. Now see what you've done, Bill. Me? This is all your fault, Ben. We have to find that truck and return it to Edward immediately. But when Bill and Ben went to find the special truck, it was gone. The truck's not here, Bill. Well, I can see that, Ben. And if we don't find it soon, Christmas will be ruined. No decorations. No presents for the children. <laughs> and no food for the Christmas dinner. My snack! You better find that truck right away, Bill. Me? But you're the one that lost it, Ben. Did not. Did too. Did not. Did too. Salty, have you seen a truck? Yar. You mean like that one? Oh no, we're not gonna do that gag again. We mean a rail truck. Yar. Well, if it's not here, another engine must have taken it. Could be anywhere on the island by now. Yar. Anywhere on the island? The twins looked all over the island. Up hills, down hills, at the docks, stations, cameo, the shunting yards, and even in tunnels. Hello, Christmas truck? Express coming through! But they couldn't find the trucks anywhere. By nightfall, Bill and Ben had searched everywhere on the island. We've looked everywhere, Ben. That truck must be on the mainland by now. What will we do, Bill? There's only one thing we can do, Ben. And together, the twins set off. Soon, the twins were at Olstead Castle. Well, hello, you two. What brings you to Olstead Castle? Oh, Edward, we're ever so sorry. Well, sorry for what? Oh, for hiding the truck. Do you mean that truck? <laughs> no, the Christmas truck. Oh, you mean this truck. <laughs> yes, that's the one. <laughs> but Edward, where did you find it? Well, let's just say you're the best at hiding trucks. 
but I am the best at finding them. What's all this about hiding trucks? Sir Topham Hat! Well, sir, the twins tried to hide my truck from me, but we learned a valuable lesson instead. Hiding trucks, eh? Then the twins are to be sent away! Mm, by my order! But, 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 but... I have no idea why we're on this boat. You didn't tell anyone we were twins, did you? No, I was too busy working. 